in the music. Alright, we are live on my end. Awesome. Well, hello everybody, welcome back to Drake's Salvation. The party has returned home to the Silver Pine from their daring deeds in no great cause and have been spending uh, quite a bit of time uh, just relaxing and being back in town. Uh, a couple of the people had little missions and uh, different things that they wanted to ensure were done in town by the time uh, Callisti wanted to take off. So, speaking of Callisti, I guess, uh, well, let's, uh, let's talk about Sean. Sean, you're in a brand new city. Everybody is, you know, tall, very tall, but they don't seem to even give you a second look as you walk through town. You don't feel like the outcasted, uh, race that you that you're used to you are just another person walking down the street and uh, i'm not sure if uh if for you that means that you uh you miss the attention or you want or uh you're just confused by it but yeah as you walk down the street just say going to the market or the coffee shop down the road you are for probably one of the first times in your life just another person all right it's definitely unusual i don't know how i feel i'm probably confused uh there is one day where you uh leave the greater city of gravencliff and you uh, wander out into the tent town because you see a group of those uh, goblins from your old tribe that uh, are heading out. It looks like they're doing some sort of a patrol, but you realize they go into a stable and are training these bone white spiders to be ridden on like war mounts. this was previously uh so this is kind of like during the downtime so okay could be it, it's let's just say like within the week mm -hmm. and we will Over. Awesome. So, like, these um, goblins I found from our old tribe, are they, like, indentured at all? Are they free? Are they on their own? Uh, no, the guard, as you walk up to the large gate, you see that the guards just let them through. They seem to have full rights as citizens, actually. Oh, this time here? Yeah. Awesome, okay. So, would there have been a chance if I had an interaction with them to see if they have an extra spider? Yeah, I mean, if you want to go talk to them. Alright. Am I on the board or I have to drag myself? You would have to put yourself down. Alright. Oh god, you have so much more stuff than I do. Let's see. <laughs> Game's been going on for over a year. <laughs> yeah. I get lost in my stuff, I can't imagine you. 
Jeez. This fight takes us a long time, the goblins. All right, so um, I guess off the break, do I recognize anybody? Um, you you would you probably would recognize them all. They're all from the same tribe that you uh, <laughs> helped liberate from the uh, from the slavers. Uh, either while they were slave, while you guys were all slaves together in the pits, or um, just uh, just throughout your daily life. You did travel a lot, so I mean, some of them, they're, a lot of them are definitely younger than you. Um, mm -hmm. You know, because life, goblin life expectancy is not very high in the water. Yeah. <laughs> but the bugbear, uh, you see, kind of raining things in and usually restraining the spiders if they get a little too hungry. Uh, his name is uh, Gist, G I Z, G I H T Z. All right. Oh, does, it, does it seem like they're struggling trying to tame these spiders? They have done it in the past, but this is a whole new group of completely wild spiders, so mm. they don't have, like, a new brood. These are captured and now trying to be tamed. All right. 